If you're just joining, I'm Sarah Stone, and today I have something to share with you that has literally transformed my daughter's behavior. Today's video is all about affection and how to get your child to be more affectionate with you. I love you, Mama. Every child is different, and some children are just naturally more affectionate. Like for instance, my son Avery, he loves to be snuggled and cuddled and hugged pretty much 24 seven. Mommy, 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 I love you, mommy, I love you. Violet has always been extremely affectionate with her brother since the moment they met. They've done nothing but hug over the years. But when it came to me and grown-ups and other adults, she's just naturally less affectionate. She would just always say she was too hot, but not anymore. Most of the time in my videos, I'm sharing tips and tricks that I've read or learned somewhere along the way. But this is something that I completely came up with by myself and I'm super proud of it because it's so easy, it's so simple, anyone can do it. Are you ready? It's called the power hug. Now this is for younger children. So your child makes a request, mom, help me get a snack, or mom, come look at this, mom, will you play with me? And I simply reply, I'm just so tired, baby. I don't have any energy. But you know what? There's a lot of power and energy and hugs. So and maybe if you could give me a hug and you know, the bigger and the longer of a hug you can give me, well, the more energy it's gonna give me to be able to do all these things you're asking for. Boom, that's it. It's so simple and it works every time. And after only a week, maybe it was even less than a week, Violet just started hugging me all the time, instinctively, without even thinking about it. And not only that, she started hugging her father more, she started hugging her grandparents all the time, babysitters, teachers, you know, tutors, anybody that comes by, she now makes sure to give special hugs and special kisses and love to, and she doesn't even care about the energy thing anymore. But this is what broke the cycle and got her into wanting to hug and be affectionate all the time. In fact, it's so effective, she won't leave the house without making sure she's gotten hugs and kisses from her mama. <sighs> Affection and hugs help your child to feel safe, secure, helps their confidence and just everything in their life. Hugs are so powerful and when you get a really good one that's long enough, your brain starts to release oxytocin, which are those love hormones that just make you feel good. People that get more hugs are actually, it's proven that they don't get sick as much because the oxytocin protects your body against stress and lower stress, well, that just allows your immune system to function better. But remember, you should never ever try to force affection on your child. That's why the power hug is so wonderful and effective. It's because the child's in control of how long they're hugging, how big they're hugging. And that's why it works so well. If you're truly listening, you put your phone away and you're truly listening to your child and you care about what they're saying, it actually starts to boost the oxytocin in not only your child, but also you. And that just totally strengthens your bond. Please comment below with your ideas of how to make your child become more affectionate. You know, it's these early ages that it's so important to imprint these ideas so that they can grow up and carry it on throughout their life. I'm Sarah Stone. I'm so happy and thankful and grateful to be here today, and I hope to see you next week. Hi everybody, welcome back. Today, today's video is all about Today's a video, most of the time I'm sharing you with He loves to be hugged, to be snugged, snugged.